Hello everyone, welcome to Public Night. So in this video, we will learn how to integrate ClickUp and Gmail. So our use case is pretty simple. When a new task is added in ClickUp, it will automatically send an email via Gmail. Now ClickUp is an awesome project management tool and Gmail is an emailing tool. So what we are going to do is, we are going to send the data from ClickUp to Gmail. But there's one minor problem. There is actually no integration between ClickUp and Gmail. So in cases like these, we need to bring a third app to connect them both. So in this video, we will be using PabliConnect to integrate ClickUp and Gmail. And the best part of using PabliConnect is, there is no need for coding skills or programming knowledge. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser. pabli.com. Press enter. Okay, so this is the website of pabli.com. Here, hover on products. And at the bottom, you will find the option called as connect. Click on connect. And then click on sign in. Okay, so this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. As you can see, I already have made an account in Pabli Connect. You can also create your own free account in just two minutes. Here, I would like to mention one more thing that Pabli Connect offers a plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So you just have to clone the template of its workflow, which is available in the description box. Once you clone the template, you will get immediate access to this amazing workflow in your account. Okay, so scroll down and at the bottom you will find connect. Here click on access now. Okay, so at the top right corner you will find a button. Create workflow. Click this. A dialog box appears in front of you. We are going to give a name to this uh, workflow. The name is click up. Click up to Gmail. Click up to Gmail. Then click on create. When you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. So in the choose app, how about we make it as click up? Because we want to send the data from click up. Now in the trigger event, how about we make it as new task instant? Now new task instant is basically a trigger event. So your obvious question is what is a trigger event? Trigger is basically a if statement. It asks a question. If the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new uh, task is made, then what action should be taken by the system? Actually, there are more trigger events like new folder, new task, new list, task updated and so on. All of them are a bunch of trigger events. However, in case if you don't find the trigger of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate pabli.com for the specific trigger that you want to build. But at present, I just want to send the data from ClickUp when a new task is made. Okay, so just click on connect with ClickUp. Now in the new credentials, we have to fill in the API token. So to get the API token, let's have a visit to our ClickUp account. Okay, so this is my ClickUp account. Here, scroll down at the bottom. And here you will find the workspace. Click on apps. Okay, so this is the API token. Copy this and simply paste it here. Okay, so we have filled in the API token. Just click on save. So when you click on save, a profile called as team is available in front of you. So the profile it is showing as Ashi's workspace. This is because, let me go back. And this is the particular workspace I have, Ashi's workspace. So my point is, we are just trying to integrate this particular workspace to Pabli Connect. And this is the webhook URL used to connect this particular workspace, okay, Ashi's workspace to Pabli Connect. So just click on save and send test request. Okay, so the API response is showing that we have integrated this particular workspace, Ashi's workspace to Pabli Connect. So uh, this means that anytime a new data is made in or a new task is made in this particular workspace, Pabli Connect has to capture this data. So as to ensure that Pabli Connect captures the data, click on this button, capture webhook response, click this. Okay, so it is showing it is waiting for the data. So how about we create a dummy task in this workspace. So I'm going to create a task. Okay, so the task name is uh, mining uranium and plutonium. Okay, mining uranium and the plutonium is the task. And I'm going to assign this task to let's say this guy, Aaron Manuel. 
okay so we have assigned this task to this guy aaron manuel and uh, we can actually enter the description uh, so the description is uh, careful uranium and plutonium are radioactive okay so this is the description and we have assigned this uh, particular task mining uranium and plutonium to this guy called as Aaron Manuel. So let's create task. Okay, so a task called as mining uranium and plutonium has been created. Now since uh, Pabli Connect is integrated with uh, this particular uh, uh, profile, um, Archie's workspace. So let's have a look whether Pabli Connect has uh, captured this data or not. So let's see. Yes, it is showing the data has been captured. So let's have a look at the details. Uh, so as you can see, this is the username that is the uh, that is Aaron Manuel, and this is the email Aaron Manuel 1991 at the rate gmail.com. Let's uh, scroll down to see more of the things. Okay, so task creation. So where is our uh, task? Where is our task? Where is the name of the task? Where is the description of the task? Okay, so it is not showing any kind of. Uh, uh, task related details like the description for example our uh, task was mining mining uranium and plutonium it is uh, not showing it the reason it is not showing is because uh, we have a id called as task id uh, let me scroll down okay so this is the task id and in this particular id all the information related to to the task is condensed okay so basically we have to extract the information from this task id so to do that just uh, click on this plus button when you click on this plus button another window opens up this time this window is called as the action window now since we want to extract the data from ClickUp, let's make this time again click up okay so now in the action event we want to extract the data from a particular id so just to make the action event as find task by task id click this and just click on connect with ClickUp. now in the new credentials we have a blank to fill called as the api token so as you may know this, we have already filled the API token. So I'm just uh, pasting the API token once again. So just click on save. Okay, so when you click on save, a blank called as task ID appears in front of you. So this button is called as the mapping button. Click this and just type task ID. Okay, so this is the task ID. Click this and map the task ID. And just click on save and send test request okay so as you can see we have got the details so the name is mining uranium and plutonium and we have also got the description careful uranium and plutonium are radioactive okay so now we are ready to sync all this data to gmail to send an email so to do that just click on this plus button so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is again the action window so in the choose app how about we make it as gmail because we want to send the data we want to send an email via gmail that's the idea okay so the choose app is uh, gmail now in the action event we have a ton of choices like uh, send an email add label to an email send email with plain text at present i'm just interested in sending an email however just like the trigger if you want more action event according to your choice you can Contact us at admin at the rate to custom build an action event for you. But at present, I just want to send an email. Okay. Then click on connect with Gmail. Okay. So in the new credentials, again, click on connect with Gmail. Okay. So it is asking me to choose an account. As you can see, I have a series of Gmail account and I want to send the email from this particular account, Michael Karas. So I'm just clicking this okay so now it is asking me to confirm my choice before you click on allow let me tell you something pabli connect doesn't take any chances with your data your data is 100 percent safe and secure with us okay so just click on allow okay okay so it is showing the authorization is successful just click on okay so when you click on OK, a set of blanks will appear in front of you. The purpose of this blank is very simple. We are going to compose a good message with the data that we have received from ClickUp via Public Connect. For example, in the recipient name, we can just map in the name, the assignee's name. So we have assigned this task to this guy called as Aaron, Aaron Manuel. OK, so this is the guy and uh, we are going to send the data to this guy okay so this is the email address that is the recipient email address okay aaron manual 1991 at the rate gmail.com and uh, since my name is michael so i'm just typing in michael okay and from email so i'm just going to type in my email address 
so i have uh, pasted my email address this is my email address and uh, the email subject is uh, basically the title or the task okay so the task was uh, that we have uh, extracted okay let me scroll down and let me show you where is the task okay so this is the task that is the task name mining uranium and plutonium click this and enter this okay so now the email message is uh, let's begin this task okay let's again enter the name of the task that is mining uranium and plutonium and uh, and there is something else we can write that is the description so careful uranium and plutonium are radioactive okay so this is the email message let's begin this uh, task mining uranium and plutonium and we have the description careful uranium and plutonium are radioactive okay so basically we have filled all the details that we want just click on save and send test request okay so the api response is showing that the data has been sent the email has been sent okay so uh, the recipient name is aaron manuel and this is the recipient's email address so let's have a look in the recipient's email whether we have uh, this uh, email concerning the assignment of this task so this is the email address of the person aaron manuel and this is the email mining uranium and plutonium okay so this is the email let's begin this uh, mining task uh, uranium and plutonium and careful uranium and plutonium are radioactive excellent so the presence of this email shows uh, that we have successfully integrated uh, uh, clickup and gmail with help of public connect so how about we double check if the integration is working fine or not but before that let me show you the whole gist of the process in public connect so this is my public connect once more and uh, i'm minimizing my action window and i have minimized again my action window and i have minimized my trigger window okay so i have minimized my trigger window okay so basically this is the whole process in a nutshell first you integrated click up to pabli connect and then you have extracted all the information related to the task from a particular task id and then you have integrated gmail to pabli connect so now there is a perfect flow of data between click up and gmail excellent so how about we double check the integration by making one more task okay so i'm going to create one more task so mining vibranium vibranium okay so many geeks will know what's a vibranium it's a element uh, so we are going to assign this uh, particular task to let's say this guy lichi okay we have assigned this uh, task to this guy called as lichi so let's have a look uh, let's add some description so uh, the description is <laughs> careful uh, vibranium is not real okay okay so it's basically an element in mcu universe marvel cinematic universe not really real okay so just click on create task okay so a task called as mining vibranium has been created so let's have a look into this uh, uh, person's uh, email address whether uh, they have got the uh, email so this is how we go into this yes uh, we have got the email let's begin this task mining vibranium and careful my vibranium is not real excellent so our integration is working fine not just these two apps you can integrate up plenty of applications using pabli connect if you have any queries contact us at admin at the rate pabli.com our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows or better just visit our website www.pabli.com it's awesome Thanks.